Hello, I'm Joe Wren. This winter has been rough on animals. Officials at the Bloomington Animal Shelter say they're receiving a lot of calls from residents concerned about pets left outside in the cold. WTIU's Samantha Estes reports. The dogs, cats, and bunnies at the Bloomington Animal Shelter are warm and safe despite the nearly half a foot of snow that blanketed the community last night. Director Lori Rinquist says it's too cold for pets to be outside. What we do see um, are more calls from citizens who are concerned about animals that they see outside in this weather. So we do get more calls to go out and check on animals. The animal shelter is getting about five times as many calls now as it does during the warm weather months. Dogs like humans are susceptible to hypothermia. Dorinda Broglin Bartlett, a Blue Sky Veterinary Clinic technician, explains the symptoms to look out for. Shaking, lethargic, um, in severe cases, um, unable to walk, dizziness, um, coma. <laughs> um, if you suspect hypothermia, the best thing to do is to take a towel, warm them up with a towel. You can even use a heating pad or a heating blanket. Broglin Bartlett says different breeds are more susceptible to winter weather dangers. Dogs with short legs, like her corgi Tallulah, do not do well in snow. And dogs with short hair, such as Dobermans and Dachshunds, cannot be in cold temperatures for extended periods of time. And here's that chilly weather forecast tonight. A slight chance of snow lows down to 8 degrees. And in the five-day forecast tomorrow, partly cloudy, highs around 16. A 30% chance of snow back in the forecast on Friday. Still cold, highs only up to 17. 27 by Saturday before 31 degrees the high by Sunday.